So this week I put in a new garden. And you know, it only took one day to put in. And I've found through putting in all the gardens that I've put in in the past that there's a very easy way to do it. I'm going to show you real quick. Because I first laid out the outline of the garden with the wood, the landscaping timbers. I then took a shovel and I cut down, I pushed the shovel down just barely an inch, maybe two inches into the grass. And what that does is that penetrates the top layer of grass, they call it the O layer of the soil. And I came out around and I kind of twisted the tip of the shovel up underneath the lip of the grass so that you can feel where the roots of the grass end. And I did this all the way down the line here, here, so that I have a straight line, a cut in the grass all the way down the edge of where I want my garden to be. I then move the wood and make sure to keep track of where I've cut. And I take the shovel and I tilt it all the way back as flat as it'll go and I push it underneath that top inch of grass. And what it does, and then I wiggle it up to try and loosen that soil and I keep pushing it under. And eventually what you'll get is you'll cut off the top layer of sod. And you do this in small foot by foot sections until you go all the way down the line and you have a garden. If I lift this up, you can see where the edge is of the grass is and that the level of the garden level is lower than the edge of the grass. You're gonna have to have a wheelbarrow handy to get rid of all the extra sod. It can be pretty heavy, um, but you can immediately plant stuff in the garden. I've already planted some shallots and some onions. One of the problems is that you lose the top layer, which is the humus rich layer, the O layer, which is okay if you're gonna compost. Um, it's just, you know, some people say, you know, it's not sustainable, it's not organic because you're losing that, that top layer. But, you know, you're gonna compost, and so it'll be restored in no time at all. So that's an easy way to put in a garden. You know, it's labor intensive because the sod is heavy, you're gonna get muddy, uh, and you know, a lot of worms will die in the process, but and there are plenty of worms in the world. Uh, it's probably the least destructive method of putting in a new garden, and it's, it's fast.